Congratulations, we're ready to graduate. Before our special day, I have some helpful reminders and how to and where to tips to make everything run smoothly. Your resource for this information and more is at csus.edu forward slash commencement. You should have already filed a petition to graduate with the Office of the University Registrar. The Degree Evaluations Office reviewed your coursework to make sure you have completed all the requirements needed to receive your diploma. If you haven't finished this step but expect to graduate this semester, please visit or call the Registrar's Office immediately. In the semester you are eligible to graduate, you will receive a brochure with commencement details to the mailing address you have on file with the university. Your college will also email you to share details specific to your ceremony. Be sure to mark your calendars for your ceremony's time and date. Next, let's get everything ready so you can participate in the procession. All students attending the commencement ceremony are required to wear academic regalia, including a cap and gown. You can purchase them right here in the Associated Students Business Office in the University Union. You can also purchase your tassel, master's hood, and honor cords here. So let's see. Grad check complete, cap and gown ready, Make sure you confirm the date and time of an RSVP with your college. If you or your guests need special accommodations for disabled seating, please confirm with the commencement office at csus.edu forward slash commencement. Now we're off to graduate. Today's the day. Make sure you arrive an hour in advance prior to your ceremony so you can line up with your fellow graduates. Please remind your family and friends to arrive early too, since seating inside is first come, first serve. You can invite as many guests as you wish, and tickets are not required. Please make sure you and your guests bring cash for parking at the arena. No credit or debit cards are accepted. Thank you, and congratulations. Thank you. The arena has several items that are not permitted inside. Please make plans to leave these in your car or at home. The arena does not allow balloons, large bags or backpacks, outside food, signs, posters or flags, or alcohol. For a complete list of items, please visit the commencement website. After you park, please follow signs for the graduate entrance. Family and friends will be directed through a different entrance on the main concourse. Please look for Sac State staff and volunteers to guide you. Don't forget your cap and gown, and please leave any prohibited items behind. Commencement is an alcohol-free event, and being under the influence may prevent you from participating in the ceremony. You may bring your mobile phone, but please turn off the ringer. Are you following along on social media? Use hashtag SacStateGrad on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, or wherever you are sharing. Look at that, an hour until commencement. Let's go inside. As you enter the arena, you will pass through security and onto the backstage area. Your college's coordinators will direct you where to line up, usually by major. They are your best source of information, but here are a few quick tips. There are restrooms in the staging area, but none on the arena floor. Graduates are asked to remain in place during the entire ceremony. Your college's ceremony will last between 90 minutes to two and a half hours. You'll participate in a formal entrance processional and after the ceremony, a formal exit recessional. Guests may take photos and videos from the stand and there will be a professional photographer taking your photo during the ceremony. You'll receive proof by email in a few days. Which brings me to this exciting point. All graduates' names are read out loud during the ceremony. You don't need to fill out anything in advance. In fact, you'll find a pencil and card on your seat during the graduation ceremony. Just fill it out, printing your name clearly and using a phonetic spelling if your name is hard to pronounce. Hand it to the reader as you move toward the podium. Your name will be called from this card. On your seat, you'll also find a commencement program booklet with the name listed by college and department. Your guests will also receive a copy of the program as they enter the arena stands. After the ceremony, your guests can meet you outside the arena. Guests are not permitted in the assembly area or on the arena floor. And what about that diploma? You won't receive it at your commencement ceremony, as a university needs to complete degree verification. You can expect to receive it by mail, so make sure your current address is on file through my Sac State. Two last tips. You can find all this information and more on the commencement website at csus.edu forward slash commencement. 
And as a graduate, you join a network of hornets that is more than 220,000 strong. Keep in touch through the Alumni Association and its social media channels. Just look for Sac State Alumni on Twitter, LinkedIn, or Facebook. I know you'll hear this a lot, but congratulations! We're so Hornet proud of you.